and welcome to another video. Today we try to fix this airbag issue. We should delete the crash. This car it was involved in an accident. It comes from an Audi A6. It's a B7. It's the first time when I tried to read this type of airbag issue with CG100. This is exactly what I will use today. I managed to make this airbag issue with a different programmer in the past. But today as I said I will try to give a read of this one. We should, uh, if I don't make a mistake, read the EE prom. But I will go through the software, maybe the CG100 have uh, different uh, diagrams. Okay, I will start the software. Okay. Europe, Audi. And it's 4E0. Okay, it's only one model. Okay. Also, in this case, we should remove the EE prom and give a read. This airbag is you have eight screws. It can hold the entire carousery. Okay. Okay, and our EE prom is located here. Okay, let's try to read this EE prom. Again, okay, to this adapter, I will try to use this clamp. Okay. From what I noticed, I have a bent pin here. The pin one will be here. Okay, let's try to give a read. You notice we don't have reading. I will uh, unsolder the EE prom. Okay, let's power up the hot air station. You should remember the position of uh, your chip. I will use this adapter. Okay. Let's give a read now. And as you can notice, the CG100, it cannot repair this type of airbag. Okay, it doesn't have uh, auto repairing. On this case, the CG100 is not special. There's no difference if you use the CG100 who cost 500 euro, or you'll use the UPA clone who will be 30 euro, or you'll have another programmer from Amazon who will cost you 12 euro, and he can read this type of memory, 95640. It is very easy to read this memory. And uh, it's very bad because the CG100 doesn't have the option to uh, repair this airbag issue. 
We close here. I will do repair this airbag. I will use dump file. Okay, but the purpose of this video it was only to show you for Audi B7 it cannot do this type of repairs. Okay, we close here and like always. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.